wanted to be recording earlier, but we, we've been working on the co the coca pillar. It's like a bus for your Kerbals, except way safer than your average bus. You see, we've added some great, great efficient features for gas mileage, such as a, a, uh, oh wait, that's not, that is not what I wanted to power. I want to power this one. <laughs> All right, anyways, as I was saying, uh, such as a jet engine to, I really have to turn these ones off before I go into the air. <laughs> Whoops. Hate it when that happens. Okay, okay, here we go. Uh, currently we're trying to see what its maximum speed is. Alright. The question of maximum speed is about to be answered. Here we go. Here we go. Whoa! Oh! But once again, Coca survives. He's just incapable of dying. And look how happy he is watching his friends die. Brilliant. All right. There we go. We can put a thing around Jeb or uh, Coca, not Jeb. Sorry. It's like protective or something. There we go. The protective fuel tank. Very nice. Yep. Okay, so we want most of the heavy lifting to be done by the Junos, but we'll see how this goes. It's really all about fuel consumption. Of which we are consuming quite a bit. I'm gonna try to get the Junos to hold us as, as hard as possible. But I think we're falling. Yeah, we're falling. Damn. Some of you are saying there's no way this will end well. But was there ever a chance of that on one of my videos? I mean, come on, let's be honest. Come on. Come on. Oh, come on, baby. Ah! How frustrating. All right, let's see what kind of speed we get out of it at least. Okay, the control is not very good. But it's definitely more powerful. I'm really wrestling with it to keep it from falling apart. We've got to be losing a lot of our potential to the, to the just controls and lateral movement. All right, three, two, one. Oh, the control. Come on, Gimbal, come on. Oh, boy. Now, 
without This is mission control. We still have contact with the with the coca pillar. It's beautiful from up here. Oh my god. Oh, just in the nick of time. Okay, only one of them is working. Come on. Come on. Oh my god. Oh my. Or we will flip upside down and lose all of our Delta V because we are unstable. Whoops. Okay, let's 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 try that again. I mean, I could throw out a parachute and save it, but I'm assuming if you want to see it fall to the ground, you want to see it explode. They all survived. I I don't know how. <laughs> I, I I don't know how they survived. The entire thing just exploded. All that was left was the Kerbals. They must be made out of something strong. Come on, baby, come on. We've burned everything we've got. The moment of truth is here. Ladies and gentlemen. We have made it to space. We did it. We made it into space. Not only did we make it into space, but we're going to make it to 125,000. No, we couldn't have made it into orbit, but I mean, let's let Coca do a spacewalk. He's had a long, long day. Why, why is the controls like this? How do I make the controls not off? Uh, anyone know how to switch the controls so it's not, like, weird? And he faces where I'm looking? Why are the controls all messed- oh, SAS, is that it? No, that's not helping. SAS is not helping. He's still being controlled weirdly. I turned off SAS. I need help. I'm not going to be able to get him back into the damn seat. Why is the control so weird? What's going on? What is going on here? Huh. Enter the seat. Hmm. Maybe it's because I didn't hit the EVA button. Maybe I have to specifically hit the... I don't know, that's weird. 
See if I go to docking mode. No. It's just as bad. Oh well. I can kind of control him. Interesting. Can it re-enter? That's, that's, that's the new question of the day. It might be able to. It may not be able to. Lives do depend on this. But, uh, unfortunately, I have zero control over it, so, like, it'll either work or it won't. I'm hoping that those jet engines have enough... Why can't I throttle or anything? Why do I have no control over the ship? Docking mode, is that why? I think that's why! Oh god, no! Turn on! Engines! Wait. Oh! Come on, baby! Come on! Come on! Oh! Yes! Oh. My. God. <laughs> That was stressful. That was legitimately a little bit stressful. Controlled landing. Controlled landing time. My friends, we've made it. We went to space and we re entered. I don't think there's any real commercial or realistic applications for this rover. Maybe it would be useful packaged up and put in the moon without any of the control surfaces or the uh, jet engines. However, we did it. That in itself is a success. Now the crew is ready to explore a great new land. It can't actually fly, by the way. Oh my god, and it has roll bars! <laughs> That is hilarious, it protected them. That's great, I love it. I don't know if I can get them out of this situation.
Yeah, I think they may be screwed. <laughs> there is always the back engine. Come on! Oh! Come on! Roll, boy, roll! Actually, I have an idea. I was thinking with only two. Maybe with only one. Okay, maybe not. Okay, they're stuck. Darn it! Okay, fine, 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 fine. Although I do want to see how it handles on its own. So let's go ahead and pop off the uh, extra stuff and just drive it around a little bit. I mean, we went through all this. All right. Oh no, motor burned out. That's unfortunate. We don't need that, but we do need that. So this thing should actually be able to fly. It's kind of cool. I don't know how well. But we'll see. Oh, it needs to be empty first, the fuel tanks. Ah. I guess we can just throw out some of the fuel. Still not light enough? Oh, come on. You can do it. I mean, we don't have much runway left. Uh, I think if I jettison anything else, it'll unbalance the craft. Oh! 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 Shoot! One side of it lifted off. Whoop! 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 I mean, she's beautiful. Come on. We have to admit it. I don't know, guys. I think I think this may be the end of the stream. We've been streaming for... Three hours. Three hours. I mean, this can also be used as a weapon. We very carefully aim it at the uh, buildings over here. JK, I'm not killing my Kerbals. Oh shoot, I think I just killed my Kerbals. Whoops! Wow, they finally died. What a fitting end. Wow, thank you for watching. Leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed. If you want me to do more Kerbal Space Program stuff in the future, make sure to share the video. The more successful it is, the more likely I am to do more stuff like it in the future. And don't miss the stream next time, because, you know, there's a lot more to the stream.
And then they're unlisted, and then you'll never know what happened there. Dun dun dun. Thank you, end credits gang. Peace out.